Okay, we are back. It's been a, uh, it's been a bloodbath the last few episodes. But I do not intend on losing anyone for a while. Uh, the team is as it stood after that annoying fucking battle. Uh, this episode, we're gonna go through Mount Coronet, through Route 208, and we're gonna get to Heart Home City. Um, probably in this episode we'll be able to explore the city and see what's going on there, but... That's about it. Now, as far as what we're doing this episode, we do have a boss battle for sure. Now, hold up. According to one theory, Mount Coronet is where the Sinnoh region began. In a newly created world, a world where only time flowed and space expanded, there should have been no strife. But what became of that world, because the human spirit is weak and incomplete, strife has spread. This world is being ruined by it. I find this state of affairs to be deplorable. Pushes me out of the way. Fuck you, bro. And, you know, we already got an encounter here, so... Uh, yeah, we have to fight an Elite Four member right before we get to Heart Home City. I just remember that because I remember losing a Pokemon or two to him. Uh, I think it's the Bug Guy, so he's gonna have, like, Scizor and, like, Venomoth and shit like that. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead... Ooh, we have a Hiker. I'm gonna throw Gex in front and get him some EXP. Hippopotas. I've always liked Hippowdon. Definitely one of my favorite Gen 4 Pokemon. One Giga Drain should take care of you. God, when I fast forward, it is insane. And a Bronzor. Nice. Okay, so we have this guy. Now, normally I would put Jawbreaker in front, but I want Aerodactyl to be a higher level fighting this bug Elite Four dude because I, I want to be able to kill stuff in one hit with Rock Slide. So, yeah. Alright, Black Belt Kyle is going to leave him the choke. No problem. I should be able to fuck you up with a wing attack. That did not Oko. That's fine. Ow, dude. What the fuck, man? Jesus Christ. It would be a Kyle. Fucking punching through drywall and shit. The Kyle memes are fucking hilarious. I, I really like the drywall punching memes and the monster and stuff. That's funny. Oh, TM75 Swords Dance. Now we can put that on people and set up if we wanted to. Okay, so we have another hiker. Throw Gex back in front. What do you got, Robert? Marowak. I should definitely be able to Oko that thing. Nice. And then we have another hiker. Okay. Let's go ahead and take a look. So I don't have an item on you. Let's give you an item. Not using items like I should be. Expert bell, boost power, super effective moves, crit ratio, poison type, ground type. I'm going to put the expert belt on Aerodactyl. Uh, I don't have a Miracle Seed on you. Miracle Seed. We're going to put the Mystic Water on you. And what do you need? I guess I'll give you a... Do I have a Twisted Spoon? I'll give you... No, not a Focus Band. Do I have the Twisted Spoon? Or was that in the other game? I don't think I have it yet. I'll just give you the... Scope Lens, fuck it. And then... Hopefully Flimble Snur is holding the charcoal, yes. Okay. Just want to make sure that we're all fucking good to go. So Route 208 is a new encounter, so let's see what I get. It's a Roselia. Okay. That's pretty cool. I mean, almost got fucked up by a Roserade, so I uh, can't exactly complain. Can't really go in. I don't want to get sludge bombed by that thing. Uh, I don't know if it would have extra sensory, but I think I could live it if it had it. It's going to go for fucking sleep powder. That is so goddamn annoying. Okay. Now I'm just going to throw some Pokeballs. The more healthy the Roselia, the more pleasant its flowers aroma. Its scent deeply relaxes people. Yeah, I'll give it a name. Let's see. What is a good name?
for a flower thing. What's the name of that? Uh, I'll name it Lily. Even though it's not a lily, it's a rose, but whatever. Okay. Let me go ahead and heal up my fucking Flimblesner here. And let's fight this bitch. Oh, Roselia. Look at that. Okay, now we got a Sunflora. Heal you up. I'm gonna go ahead and put Flimblesner in front because this dude's like an artist and he's definitely gonna have smear goals for days. Did he just use Frenzy Plant on me? And then Hydro Cannon? That's fucking crazy. And we got the odd Keystone, so we can fight. We can go catch Tombstone. Nice. Uh, we're gonna fight a Bug Guy. I'm pretty sure that we fight him in here. I'm gonna go ahead and put Terror in front. Hopefully with the Expert Belt, we can just Oko everything with Rock Slide. But we'll, we'll see how that goes. I'm probably gonna miss and get killed, so... Hello, you're a trainer, aren't you? Oh, he heals them. Great. I love wasting medicine. I'm Aaron. Uh, he's a huge fan of bug Pokemon. Let's just let's just do this. I'll fight you, Aaron. Hopefully he's not too overleveled. He, he can't be higher than, like, 32. Okay, level 31. Let's see if I can not miss. Nice, I hit. And I O-code. Thank you. That's exactly what I needed. Okay, now we got a Scizor. So, Flimblesnur... I should be able to take any move this thing hits me with, unless it crits. He did not crit, and I did not miss for some reason. I just expect everything I do to not work correctly. Alright, now we got a beauty fly. That thing is definitely bug flying, so we're going to go back into terror and just rock slide it into next week. Don't miss. Thank you, thank you, thank you for not missing. What? He has a Focus Sash and goes for Psychic. That is obnoxious. That is fucking obnoxious as fuck. I really, really, really want full health, man. I mean, surely... No, he's probably going to have Giga Drain. I do not want to go into Tsunami. Fuck, man. I guess I'll just fucking Wing Attack. Didn't work that time, did it? Of course it worked the first time. Alright. Venomoth. So, Bug Poison. Is it Bug Poison or Bug Flying? Either way, he's probably going to have an air move. He's going to have a bug move, like Bug Buzz. He's going to have, like, probably Sludge Bomb. And then probably, like, Giga Drain or something. So, can I kill it in one hit is the question. Will it do... So, Bug Buzz is going to do nothing to me, so he's not going to use it. And Air Move would do nothing to me. He's going to hit me with Sludge Bomb. The question is, is my special defense high enough where it would only do half? I don't know the answer to that. I have to stay in, though, I think. Because... No, he's going to have Psychic. He's going to have Psychic, Sludge Bomb, like Air Slash, and then Bug Buzz. So, Jawbreaker's out. Christmas is out. Tsunami probably can't take a hit that well. Gex is definitely out, and then Flimblesner's out, so I, I have to stay in regardless. Uh, half of 93 is like 46, so I'm currently over half. So if I'm going to gamble on living this, I need to do it now and not heal. Because, like, for instance, let's say his move does more than half, then I would miss out by healing, and I wouldn't be able to get... I would have less chance of getting two attacks off. So, I'm just going to go for a rock slide. Don't miss. I missed! And I lived. That was fucking stupid. Of course I missed. Like, actually, of course. Now we have to do some stupid shit. Oh my god, that is so fucking stupid. So, I don't have hyper potions, so I can't just heal past it. It definitely did less than half. I didn't think it would, but it did. Who 
Who can take a sludge? Tsunami could easily take a sludge bomb. <sighs> but I don't want to get hit with Giga Drain. I don't know if he has it or not. I have Rock Slide. He would probably be more inclined to hit Tsunami with Bug Buzz. Okay. If I stay in and I miss with Rock Slide, I'm going to lose. I don't believe that Wing Attack is strong enough to kill him. Even though it's Expert Boot. I mean, what, it, what does this thing's stats look like? I'm going to look up at Stat Block. I mean, it, it's changed in Dreano, but it'll give us... It'll tell me what it's... Yeah, it doesn't really have defense. I might be able to kill it with Wing Attack. But if I go into Tsunami, I can absorb a Sludge Bomb easily, because I'll resist it. Then he's probably going to go for Bug Buzz. So I can go into Tsunami, I can heal. I'll Quad Resist Bug Buzz on Terror, and then I should be able to take a Sludge Bomb. As it stands now, I believe that I'm going to lose somebody. This is this is this is a hard call. I have two viable options. I could stay in and go for it and maybe kill it. But if I don't, if I don't, then I lose terror, which isn't the biggest deal in the world because I have two flying types. But I might lose this battle if I lose terror now. So I'm gonna go into tsunami. We're gonna risk it for the biscuit. Why did you go for psychic? That, I think that's fine. Should I just attack? Okay, so Psychic is non-stab, 90 power. It did... 38. I feel like I'm feel like i going to get killed. I feel like I just need to heal. I need to heal Terror. No matter what. There's Sludge Bomb. I have no words for that. I have nothing for that. I'm gonna go for a fucking wing attack. I would have killed it. Fuck you. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I wasn't attached to Tsunami at all. I don't take recoil damage, so takedown is good on uh, Aerodactyl. Alright, his last Pokemon is Drapion. That is a bug dark type. Or is it Poison Dark? It's Poison Dark. Skaroopy is bug poison. He is poison dark. Was it bug dark? I don't fucking know. Um he might have ice fang. TBH. Jawbreaker is not an option cuz of cross poison. Night slash poison. Just not defensive. I have to stay in again. And I'm going to go for a rock slide. That did fucking nothing, and he's swords dancing up. This isn't good. Do it again. He flinched. Come on, you gotta kill. 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 Please, high roll, high roll, high roll. <laughs> yes. Oh. I didn't want anyone to die, but that was a hard battle. Your Pokemon are trained seriously well. I expect I'll see you at the Pokemon League for an official battle. Oh, he gave me the team for X Scissor. Awesome. Jesus Christ. Alright, we made it to Hard Home City. Oh, thank goodness that you happened to be there. If it weren't for you, who knows how far my happening could have ran. Okay, so contest hall. That's how we get roped into that shit. What are we at? We're at 14 minutes. Let's go ahead and explore the city. Uh, Yeah, I'm definitely not going to be doing contests. Okay, that's the way out of the city. I'm visiting here all the way from the Hoenn region. Um, I offer you... No, dude. I don't want to go to the fucking contest hall. Pokemon fan club. What do you got to say? When I take my baby out in a stroller, I see the town in a different way. Okay. Good mother. Good mother. There are the contests. Then we have Amity Square. Heart Home gets visitors from all over, so things have to be nice and clean. <sighs> well, are they only all going to talk about fucking contests and shit? Like... I'm, I'm only, like, doing this because... In this game, you get so much free shit. There, Shell Bell. That's good. That's a good item. We got a lot of use out of that in our Pokemon Storm Silver Nuzlocke. 
Fuck, I am starving. Oh my god. Why am I so hungry? Definitely gotta stop by the mart. I feel I feel the baby stroll getting heavier each day. Blah, blah, blah. The Poffin House. I don't care about that. I used a Firestone on my Pokemon and it evolved. Uh, that looks like nothing. This is what we need to get to. Let me go ahead and put Tsunami in the fucking box. We are losing Pokemon, like, left and right. Honestly. We are just losing them left and fucking right. So we're going to have to think of a replacement for Tsunami. Uh, honestly, I have tons of options, so I'm not worried about that right now. I don't plan on fighting anymore this this episode, so... I've checked out the Global Terminal. Uh, do you have a Poffin case? I don't want to talk to you. Yeah. I went for a stroll in Amity Square. Uh, I don't care about that either. Looks like there's really nothing to get. I already went in there, didn't I? I did not. Lost Tower. Babies and Pokemon get along perfectly together. When babies take naps, Pokemon go to sleep right next to them. Just give me shit. I'm like, trying not to lose my patience. My sisters make so much noise, no one even notices me. Poor kid. Over there all alone in the corner. Oh well. Hardome is a kid-friendly city, they say, but I disagree. Some act kindly in hopes of being treated kindly in return, but how could that be a bad thing? All my grandchildren are clamoring for Pokemon of their own. Oh no, there are no stairs in this house. It's easier that way. The lack of stairs makes it easy for the little Pokemon to get about. I actually don't find that to be true because little Pokemon can't operate an elevator. So, I don't know. That just made absolutely zero sense. What do you got to say? Oh, right. I already talked to you. I get to see Pokemon all day long, but there are so many kinds. Isn't the contest hall, like, up here? I thought it was, like... Yeah, there it is. No, no, no. Oh, that, that one building is the contest hall. I thought in the original game it was in the top left. I guess not. This isn't it either. Welcome to the place of worship for that which we call the original one. It is the creator of both our land and the Pokemon found within legends. You'd have to be champion to even stand a chance of being worthy. What the fuck? That must be like a legendary Pokemon or something. I guess I'll get dipshit here to show me to the contest hall. Go ahead and take me on your merry way, my friend. Oh wow, I walked right by it. I lived in total seclusion up in the mountains for 30 years. 30 fucking years in the mountains. Oh, my hero. Oh, that's my uh, that's my fan. That's my one fan. Joanna is your mom, so you might be a contest star. Never Thomas have an interest. Here's a simply... Oh, the shiny stone! It's happening. And we got the glitter powder. I'm going to look up where the upgrade is, because I feel like I should have Porygon 2 by now. Where you decided to see me, I got bored, so I came out to Heart Home for a little vacation. So you just, like, came out here, huh? All by yourself. I think she's got a... I think she's getting some dick, honestly. Uh, alright, here's the gym leader. Uh, we. Contest you are here for, I hope you very much enjoy them. Incidentally, Fantina, the gym leader of Heart Home, is also a contestant. She is, how do you say, Trey Fantastique. Fantanta being myself, Fantina. Let me see, you also seem to be Trey Strong, Infin. I don't know how to speak French. So it shall be, I wait for you at the gym. Alright, I feel like this clown's got something for me. You got nothing for me. And then you have nothing for me. Okay. This might be a short episode because I absolutely, uh... I need to grind someone else up before I go into this gym. But we're definitely going to scout it out. We're going to use this on you and get an amazing Pokemon. Now we got a special wall, a really good one, that hits hard as fuck. Alright, let's check out Togekiss's stats. Yeah, see, that's some crazy shit, man. That is definitely the best Pokemon on my team right now, is Togekiss. 
Uh, let's go ahead and scope the gym out. I'm definitely going to lead with Jawbreaker because I'm confident that I could take any hit. And uh, they're probably not going to have a lot that'll threaten me. Wait, the gym's up here. What am I doing? Oh my god. Leave me alone. I know how it works. Okay. We'll base it off of this trainer. What we need to get to. Ghastly at level 27. Okay, you know what? We might be a high enough level for this. I feel like her ace is going to be 34. There's no way. Well, maybe. We didn't really fight anyone in between the last gym and this gym, so... I guess 32 is probably good. Yeah, we'll go 32. Alright, cool. So, I'm going to go ahead and, on camera... I guess we'll decide who we want to replace Tsunami with. I mean, that's a that's a tough loss, but, you know, it's okay. It'd be like that sometimes. Okay. Level 32 is what I was uh, what I'm grinding to. Uh looking at my party, I have a special attacker and a wall. I got a kind of a bad wall, but kind of a bad psychic type. I got a hard hitting Rock flying type, I have a shitty firefighting type, and a shitty grass type. So, water, steel, rock, no, not rock, so water, steel, bug, poison, normal, you know what? It's time. I'm going to add Neo to the party, because I'm almost 100% certain that the upgrade is within range. So yeah, I'm going to end the episode here, it's going to be a short one. Next time... I'm going to go through the gym and try and get my third badge, and we'll see what happens. So, I'll see you all next time. <sighs> Sometimes you just got to risk it for the fucking biscuit.